Suica. How's it going, everybody? Hi. <laughs> As you know, your boy is not part of the tournament. But I wanted something quote unquote relaxing. <laughs> And uh, I was looking through my Steam library. It wasn't really having anything. Look what everyone else was uh, looked at. What everyone else was playing, and uh, <laughs> it's Seika. It's Seika, baby. So I thought, hey, why not? It's 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 been a while. How are y'all doing? Hope you're doing well. Hope you're having a good time. I've been fighting with technology for the past couple of days. I I think that. This is my first stream since the event. Uh, like, as you, as you all uh, might have known, I was a guest as, at uh, Koskoski uh, a couple of days back. And, uh, dear God, ya boy is cursed. Let me just jump into the game and we can have our story time. So, obviously, m m despite the technical hiccups, despite the technical hip hiccups, I had a blast. It was so nice to see everybody coming out to hang out and uh, doing the meet and greets as always. So th that was a blast. But I was cursed, man. My, so much of my equipment just crapped out on me for seemingly no reason. And I was panicking to fix it. Like things were just not working the way they were supposed to. But at the very least, I got to like learn a little bit of the languages and I got to sing blue light and I got to see meet everybody like face to face which is always a blast but god I it, dur during when everything was happening and obviously is when when these things happen or or like when when we're doing events we're always talking to like uh, we're both talking to just uh, both event staff and we're talking to like uh, Niji staff and when <laughs> when everything was crapping out on me and I was like trying to find ways to like Proceed with the panel. It it was bad, man. I I this is really embarrassing to admit, but I st I almost <laughs> I started crying and like telling staff like I don't know what to do. Things are not working. I feel like I feel so bad. Like I don't know what to do. How are we gonna fix this? And they st staff uh, was very very nice. They 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 <laughs> dealt with my panicking. In a very orderly manner and was just like it's all right ike we'll figure something out everybody is like sure sure they're they're patient i'm sure they're gonna be understanding which i which god bless uh, staff son because if it weren't for them i i probably would have freaked out way more than i did but it worked out in the end we we got everything working as good as we could the only thing that uh, that I was a little bit sad about is that we were gonna have like a little bit of a like, n not a drawing segment, but I was supposed to write out answers like in paint, and I was I was so sad because like I had prepared like a drawing of Mue and everything that was gonna show up on screen <laughs> when we went to that segment, and I was like, dang it, I didn't get to show my Mue. I'm I'm so sad. <laughs> So that, 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 that was the one thing that didn't end up going out the way that we had intentionally planned. But it is what it is. It, it, it was a fun time nonetheless. I hope that I can go back someday. I would love to be a guest again and that next time, dear God, let's hope that things work the way they're supposed to. You can always stream the web part, I guess I can. Can you show us again? I mean, you saw the thumbnail. Where is there? Where is always there? It's a, we can thank Icaso for that wonderful, wonderful thumbnail. We need Mue Part Two. How would you have a Part Two to to a person without having it, having it be like offspring? Is that not a sequel to a person? But sometimes, you know, the sequel is not as good as the, the original. <laughs> That's a horrible way of looking at it. When you think about it, every single person is a sequel.
Isn't that wild when you <laughs> when you give it some thought? Why? Why not? <laughs> Why are you booing me? I'm right! <laughs> God, I haven't played this in so long. I'm I'm so I'm so head empty. I I I've not paid attention to like any strategies or anything. So we're just gonna finagle around with this and see what happens. I have I I've I've pa I'm in in the three K club. That's then that, that's what's the most important part here. So there's no reason for me to get heated. I say, but who knows, maybe I'll eat my words a little bit later. That remains to be seen. Oh god, what am I doing? I mean, I guess this works. Yeah, we had two, we had two momos. It's all good. Oh, how, how am I going to do this? Does this work? No, no, it doesn't. Oh, well, it's all right. We're just chilling. While I've been dealing with my technical struggles and work behind the scenes, I've been just chilling and watching everybody practice for the tournament and seeing how everything went down. It was very exciting. Some some of the turnouts were not what I had expected. So there's there's plenty of surprises to go around. Hopefully day two is just as exciting. They did so well. They did! And Shu and Dopio doing a great job hosting as well. Everything's just a blast. Blasting good vibes. Mm. Things are not going the way that I want them to, but it's our it's alright, whatever. I'm I'm not I'm not trying to be sweaty this time around. I am fully content doing the most painfully average putting on the most painfully average performance. That you can imagine. The amount of grapes here, though, like, geez. D dang, that strawberry is committed. That that strawberry was committed to to be like, no, these will not match. Grapes are the new cherry, and <laughs> they're just hanging out, having a good time. Uh, where do I put this? I don't know. There are no good places for me to put anything right now. But that's all right. Like Sue. Ooh! Oh, that almost almost bumped it all the way. We mm -hmm. this here and that there maybe I don't know. As much as I love strawberries in Suica, they're evil. Yeah, the tiny berries are very evil, and you you know your boy really likes strawberries, but in this game, I don't know, man. They can go somewhere else. Any fruit to motteru no kawaii? <laughs> yeah, this little acid. Yeah, it was really cute. I found it. I found it when Suika was at like its peak, and I was like, "That's adorable. I'm gonna use that." Thank you for making it. Happy Nyike Day! Oh yeah, I forgot that we made that a thing. Speaking of cats, did you guys see Shinkun's new outfit? 
means that the whole TCB gang have proper glasses. Like actual, honest to god glasses. Megane, yeah, full on Megane gang all across the board. Me, Aniki, and Sinkun. Ah, there it go. There it goes. Whoa, it's weird seeing it in English. What? What the heck? Why is the M in my score lowercase, but the these are capitalized? Why? Oh well. Let's go again. <laughs> Maybe, maybe their goals are beyond my understanding. Hey yo, hey yo, is there a rainbow happening? What, what, what's the occasion? What's the occasion for the rainbow? I'm, 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 more, I'm very curious. Dang it. I wait with bated breath to see what the occasion is. Will I get answers? Or am I doomed to ponder this question? Okay, got it. I mean, do we really need there to be an occasion for the rainbow? I would prefer if there was an occasion because the otherwise I'm gonna be like, what did I do? What did I do to deserve this? I don't understand. What's the problem? I didn't do anything. What? Oh, I should have put that over there instead. Oh, no, it's dumb on me. Okay, wait, no, this can work. Make you can make something out of that, maybe. Oh, oh, not if it wraps to the other side. A rainbow for the one and only boy. I am far from the only boy. There are plenty of boys in this world. Exploding every quiller and hard way with blue light. <laughs> like live, what did I do? Shrugs? <laughs> I'm just glad that it turned out okay. Blue light is hard. I was nervous as heck. I had to like approach the notes way differently than I did in like the recorded version. Because in the recorded version, I like sing things in a way that is like a lot more difficult. But because it's a studio version, I can do that because I have unlimited retries. Whereas live, you don't have that. And that's why live is scary. <laughs> Whoa! That was cool! You didn't quite sound nervous. You. Oh, that scroll up. You sounded confident, in my opinion. Thanks. <laughs> yeah, I, I, I approach things like instead of um, belting like uh, properly with like chest voice, uh, I sang in a more compressed mix voice which sounds more narrow but it's easier to go up into higher ranges with it's a lot of more closed off thin and narrow kind of tone if you have an ear for it i'm sure you that you can notice that kind of stuff i'm sure plenty of you did you're a smart bunch Many children sang blue light together with you. I saw, I saw some of the fan cams. And ah, it feels so surreal. It's like seeing that many people singing along to something goofy. Goofy and edgy that your boy made. I don't know, man. It's it's odd. It's an odd feeling. I'm very much not used to this. I don't know if I ever will be. I wonder, will the rainbow be completed? Narisara, thank you very much. Can you give me a Swedish boyfriend yet? 
Uh, no, probably not. I mean, if you want a Swedish boyfriend, like, uh, I don't know, G go to Sweden. I'm, I'm sure there's somebody. If you're asking me to, like, matchmake you, to, like, hook you up with someone, bold of you to assume I have friends. <laughs> There it is! Hachiwashi Hachi-san, thank you very much for the rainbow super chat! Eto, Aiku-kun, Kosukoski event, Otsukare sama deshita! Hontoni, hontoni tanushikata desu! Eto, hmm? Happening ga atta no ni watashi tachi wa tanushimasu te kurete arigato! Blue light ga kikete ureshikata desu! Arrange mo steki deshita! タイに行くってよかったです。I love your song. 本当にありがとう。嬉しい。ありがとうございます。I'm glad that it, that it was a good experience. There's a lot. There's a lot of children doing a lot of traveling, because I have done meet and greets in like in in different parts of the world. Like there 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 have been ones in. In the U.S., like the, we have had meet and greets in the U.S., and I think, yeah, I've only, I've only done. Whoa, 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 whoa! What happened there? In the U.S. and Thailand, Th those are the meet and greet places that I've done, I believe. But I keep seeing the same people. <laughs> Taipei too. Oh yeah, that's true. Taipei too. You're right. It's very, very true. Floof go flying around. Really? <laughs> you guys are a bunch of globetrotters. I see the same people show up here and there, and I'm like, oh god, wait, hold on a second. Why are you here? How did you get here? <laughs> Last time I saw you, we were in California. What are you doing at the opposite side of the world? I feel like Patrick in that one shot from Spongebob where he's just like, Who are you people? Ooh, oh, oh, this, this could work. This could work. Nice. H Hello. Hello again. Hello and again. <laughs> Hi, Arova. Thanks for the super chat. One of the globe trotters right there. Uh, okay, I just want another one of those boys over there. And this could work, right? Surely. Quillen travel through IKEA. <laughs> oh yes, the IKEA slip space gate. I forgot about that. It's usually hidden somewhere in the cafeteria. I should have known. I don't even know what the heck is going on here. Hello, Mr. Ike Asso. Hi, Salty. Thank you very much for the super chat. I almost cried when you appeared on my screen at the con. I felt so... <laughs> I'm very happy and, and Thai. It felt like a dream and my friend told me to say hello uncle bike to you oh so that was you i was wondering like uncle bike that's a new one not sure if i like it i don't, I don't feel like don't you have to be like a certain age to be considered an uncle <laughs> oh this could work maybe Oh. Okay, there we go. Got the Momo. Don't call me out like that. <laughs> I said. Up early for once, I see. Isn't it like eight over there or something?
Where the hell do I put this? I was up at 6 a.m. Yo, dubs. Sleep schedule dubs. Oh, dang it. That grape. Will it last? We shall see. It will not. <laughs> I relate. My sleep schedule has been awful lately. I'm trying to do me make it a little bit better. Uh, I really would like another one of those. If it... Is it gonna work? I don't know. That remains to be seen. Maybe if I put that there? No, 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 no. Okay, fine. That is okay. Oh, never mind. It's not okay anymore. Oof. Cherry's face is kind of annoying. I know! It's so... It's like sneering at you. It's the worst. Oh my god, there's so many super chat. I'm just playing Suika! What is happening? My oh me. Zenny, thank you. Ike, since it's final season, do you have uh, plans to have any study slash work stream soon? I was thinking about that, actually. Personally, I've been using your other work streams for at least six times, and I can almost remember the transcript. Anyways, good luck with the Suika, and love you as always. Thank you. And Kizu, thank you very much. Blue light live version was so touching. Here's ticket costs. <laughs> Didn't you already pay for the event? Why, why are you giving ticket costs to me? Save some for yourself. Relish in that disposable income. But yes, I am actually considering doing another work stream soon because I do have things I want, like, not necessarily need to catch on and catch up on, but like. Things I want to get done. And I feel like I... It, it's like a lot easier for me to like discipline myself or like... Make it so that I work like diligently when I'm on stream. Because I can't... Like it, it's way, way less likely for me to... One second. <coughs> Excuse me. <coughs> it's way less likely for me to be... To be tempted to just fire up YouTube and then get absolutely nothing done for three hours. Do you feel me? You okay? Yeah, I'm, I'm chilling. I have a big bottle of water right here. Mmm. Working stream, please. Yeah, we gotta do- we can do one of those. We need the accountability too. <laughs> okay, that's good. I remember the times that we've done those, those working streams, and I check the stream tag afterwards, and I see how much everybody got done. It makes me happy. It makes me proud. Bunch of y'all are a bunch of hard workers. I'm proud of you. Good job. Slide down, down, down. I say. Ho ho. Ooh, ooh, maybe this, maybe, maybe, maybe? No, no, it doesn't go down there. That was an attempt. Lydia, thank you for the 10 gifted, that's so kind of you. There's so much generosity going around and I'm just, I'm just playing Suika, what the heck? Kiyo-san, arigatou gozaimasu. Nihon kuso samui na no de aiki mite hokkori shimasu. It's, the, it's, it's, get, it's getting really, really cold in Japan now, eh? The rest of the world is slowly but surely having to endure the same thing that I have to endure. Balance is slowly being restored, <laughs> for lack of a better term. Sweden yori wa samukunai kamo. It depends. It, it depends. I actually don't know how cold it is in Japan right now. I haven't checked how cold it is today. But my guess is it's probably cold as usual.
Let's see. Uh, where do we... I'm just going full brain off. Oh, come on. That's unfortunate. Oh, well. Oh, oh, okay. I guess we're doing that. Like, Sue. So. Put that there. Uh. Oh, come on. Slide down. No? All right. <laughs> That's okay. That's whatever. Mm -hmm. Juliana, thank you very much. Concert uh, ticket payment. You don't have to do that, but thank you. As always, that rendition of Blue Light Rocked. I introduced you to my friend who also make music. That went, uh, they thought your screamo and music production were great. Thank you! That makes me very happy. If you have a duel with Luxium, who can you beat? I don't know. Depends on what we're dueling in. There's so many things that we can duel in. Like, if, for example, if we're dueling in... Uh, who can put together a computer the fastest, I think I'm going to lose. I'm not very good at that. I feel like probably Shu or Vox would be good at that. I don't really know what I would excel at. What's something I would excel at? Arm wrestle? Have you seen my arms? And have you seen the arms of the rest of Luxium? I'm at a slight disadvantage here. Being a Vocaloid nerd? Oh yeah, I win on that. I <laughs> oh god. I would absolutely clean sweep everybody. That I'm confident in. Shoo might give me a run for my money. But, but other than that, like, nah. I, I, I feel like I got that one in the bag. Eating caviar toast? I mean, that's not really... I don't know, man. <laughs> that's just consuming food. If it, if it was about who could eat the most caviar, then I might win. Isha, thank you very much for the five gifts. That's so kind of you. Number one Miku fan. <laughs> That's be, that'd be me. So happy to have a meeting group with you. Now, a quick question. Do you know how to say I love you in Thai? I wrote it down. Hold on, where are my notes? I wrote it down. It, it's it's somewhere here. Hold on a second. Oh no, where's my notes? Oh no, did I not save my notes? Oh no. I don't think I saved my notes. I I had I wrote down everything that I learned in a in a big notepad file. And then I guess I didn't save it. No. <laughs> oh, I'm going to krill myself. Oof. I, I swear, I swear I'm, I'm I'm a good student sometimes. Please, please don't be mad at me. <laughs> Man, I prepped, I prepped so much. Like, I got, like, the, the mue ready, I got my notes. And then it's just like, like, it's just the theme of technology turning against me. Except, like, the notes is probably just me being very stupid and not saving things. But it's like, usually, like, you don't really save notepad files that often, right? Or maybe that's just me, I don't know. Jesus Christ, is that 50 gifted? MPLKJPJ, thank you very much for the 50 gifted, holy crap -a 
That's incredibly generous. What the hecky? Putty Putty, thank you very much. Hello, Aki. I really enjoyed talking with you at Koskoski. Thank you for not saying no to my marriage proposal. I'm very happy that you're a happy boy. Let's get a high score today. I don't know. High score feels a little bit out of my reach, but I'm okay with that. I'm glad that it seems that everybody had a fun time. Now, if I ever get to come back, then prayer circle that the Scuffsium curse is not in full swing. Please don't quill yourself. It's bad for your health. All right. Forgot about that. I gotta be more more careful about my health. And, uh, you know, death tends to be a little bit on the... Be a little bit on the unhealthy side. Just a little bit. Have you ever made a suika? Yeah, a few times. Oh, they never stay on the side that I want them to. Whoop. I'm getting the witness stream flashbacks. Why? Why is that? Why are we talking about the witness? Oh, is it, is it because... Is it because I told Petra to buy it? I don't know if she's actually gonna play it. I just say like, hey... This is a good game. The circle, yes. The circles. I will. I, I've just at this point, I've made it my mission to get as many people playing the witness as I possibly can. Why did you do that to her? Because at this point, it's a game. And I'm winning. <laughs> Listen, in the in this day and age, entertainment is so easy to come by. You have the collective knowledge of most of humanity at your fingertips, thanks to the internet. You have basically infinite hours of entertainment through YouTube and streaming services. That's why it's special when sometimes just make a little bit of entertainment on your own. And for me, that is watching people play The Witness. <laughs> okay, come on, Momo. Come on, Momo. Okay, no space program. Let's go. Ooh, okay, that works. Neat. Uh... Oh, dang. Oh, that doesn't work out the way I wanted it to. Ooh. Come on. Ugh. Nope. Did not work. That's okay. We'll figure it out. No! <laughs> That's not where I wanted you. Oh, God. Cherry goes there. Uh... Okay, okay. Now, 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 maybe. Okay, that worked. Sort of. Hmm. He's doing a thonk. But nothing, nothing comes of it. Oh, and of course it goes flying. HC, thank you very much. Happy to meet you at Koskoski. Finally got to meet my OC and heard my favorite song, Blue Light. Although my voice is a little bit soft, it's like vocal training. Thank you for praising my photos. I'll keep pushing. You can do it, I believe! Thanks for coming to see little old me. I didn't realize that it's not that far until one million time flies. It's kind of crazy when you think about it. I just hope that 
I'm able to finish planning and preparing what I want to do for like the big milestone in time. And if I finish ahead of schedule before we're getting close to the number, then I'll just do it at a different occasion. It's gonna be fun nonetheless. It's nothing crazy or anything, but it's gonna be a lot of fun, I think. Okay, okay. And... Nice, okay. Hmm. Ooh, okay. It's worried he wasn't, wasn't gonna stay there. Uh, alright. Come on. Ooh, nice. Ah, they're not bumping into each other, though. Oh, well. We are somewhat close, aren't we? Yeah, there's like, uh, it's like 15,000 left, I think. But once again, I am bad at math. So don't quote me on that. I got it right. Oh my god, Ike gets math right. Character development. Yoko, what the heck is spaghetti? <laughs> Thank you for the Akaspa blue light. The light was so amazing. And I met Thai children at Koskos Ski. Thai children are so nice. Thank you for letting me have the chance to meet them. I also had a lot of fun traveling with other children. Like, and then how do I read that? I don't know how to read that, but thank you. I, I know how to read Ryoko. I don't know how to read the thing that comes before it. I'm sorry. I'm bad at reading... Reading Chinese... Chinese character. Shugaku Ryoko. Shugaku Ryoko. Okay. Thank you. Thank you for teaching me. School trip. Ah, I see. <laughs> it never stays where I want it to. One, two, three. Nice. Let's drop this boy over here. Let's see. Can we put these dudes? Cute beating Quildren like a school trip. <laughs> That's a nice way of thinking of it. I'm trying to think of the school trips that I've gone on. Uh, I can only really think of one. I th I, yeah, I think I think I've only ever been on like one proper school trip, like a like a proper trip, like where we really went away somewhere like far. So it didn't happen a lot, but the one time that we did go, it was it was really fun. I got to go to I got to go to Gothenburg. So we went on like a ridiculously long bus trip. And then we went to a amusement park called Liseberi. That was a fun time. I remember on the way back, like, it was, like, so late. Like, it was, like, completely dark and everybody basically slept on the bus. Myself included. It's probably changed a lot since, like, last time I was there because that was, like, years ago. Like, so many years ago. Like, there's a lot of things that you don't, un unless you sit down and actually think about it, you're just kind of like, eh, surely that wasn't that long ago. But then when you realize how long ago it actually was, you have <laughs> a little bit of an existential crisis. For example, I don't like the fact that Undertale is, th is eight years old. 
It do that doesn't that sentence doesn't feel real to me. Uh, what to do? Eight years? Yep. Time is terrifying. Ooh, nice. Did you uh, try going to a bone museum as a school trip? No, I don't think I've ever been to a bone museum. You just look at, like, bones and fossils? Oh, Marcy, thank you for the 10 gifted. That's so nice of you. Yeah, eight years. Kinda crazy. I even remember when that, like, came out. Like, everybody was talking about it, and I'm like, what is this game? And why, why, why are everybody, why is everybody covering the soundtrack? It's like a bunch of YouTube musicians, like, doing a bunch of, like, soundtrack covers. I'm like, this kind of slaps, let me look it up. And then, uh, yeah. I'm excited for the Among Us and Undertale collab. Oh yeah, I did see that. I personally, the thing that excited me the most in that image, Celeste. I got to see Celeste there. <laughs> and I was like, oh my god, Celeste mentioned! Why is Undertale brought up? Because we are talking about how it's eight years old and it doesn't feel like it. How do I get them closer? That works! Guess that works. Mm. Ooh, okay. Not ideal. Uh, come on! Dang. Bonatan, thank you very much. Can you say hello to my friend? His name is... Hmm? How do I read this? Oh my god. Eeh, let me just... Mm, Mikazuki Iron. Uh, Janakte. Arion. Well, Arion. Hiya, how's it going? Hello. Your friend told me to say hi to you. Hope you're good. Hope you're chilling. Oh, that's gonna... Mm, what to do? It's okay. Same with Your Name, it released in 2016. Yeah, Your Name was, all, was also like a, a long time ago and it does, doesn't feel like it. What's another one that feels like it was really recent? Or maybe not recent, but like you, f you feel like... You know. Oh yeah, did you know that uh, in like apparently uh, when a video game console is a certain amount of years old, it's considered retro. And by by definition, supposedly, right now the PlayStation 3 is considered retro. And I I I I don't like that. It was something like that that I saw on online. I'm offended. <laughs> I, I feel like I should be offended too. Into the 3DS could be retro. I think so. Maybe. I don't know. I don't, I don't know what the cutoff point for retro is. Like 15 years or so? Something like that? I don't know. Warren High School Host Club is 16 years old. That feels about right. Heda, what's up? Thank you for the Akka. Is this a double Su Suika arc stream? Probably not. Zali has strategy on his side. He, know he knows 
how to play efficiently, safely, and well. I just drop things and pray. So if you're looking for a double Suica, you're, you're in the wrong place. Ooh, could this work maybe? No. Okay. That's fine. Not the way that I anticipated that working out, but okay. No thoughts, just dropping fruits. Exactly. Fruits dropping harder than... I don't know. I got nothing. There we go. They do a little hop sometimes. Is the space program jank still in the game or did they fix that? I'm noticing sometimes when the fruits get launched, they instantly stop. So may maybe they maybe they patched it. Hmm. That would be very cool if they did. <clears throat> Jinxia, thank you very much. Hayaki, I just wanted to say that your voice has healed my soul. I'm using a translator, so I can't guarantee the correctness of my grammar, but I genuinely appreciate you. Thank you very much. And uh, I think the translator did its job. Thank you very much. I saw the space program in the tournament. Okay, so it's not patched then. I must have missed that. Uh, uh. Oh, come on. Out of the way. There you go. Neat. Not really sure what's happening here. Something's happening. Uh, let's drop that one over there. Surely this will work fine. Maybe. Perchance. Oh, come on. A little to the left. Come on, maybe, maybe, maybe. It's a little bit more. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Okay. We take those. Wrong game, Mikey. Sorry. <laughs> uh, maybe this? No, I just bonked it up a little bit. Hmm. Physics doing its work. I feel like a lot of the... My accomplishments that have happened in Suica game has just been to... Physics occasionally deciding to work to my advantage. Which doesn't doesn't happen very often, but when it does, I'm I'm not complaining. Did this work well, maybe? I don't know. Find out next time. Whoa! What is with the Akas today? What the hecky? Melinda Lynn, thank you very much for the Akka. Hi, Aiki. Your blue light live was amazing. I'm so glad that I decided to go to Koskoski. Even though there was some scuff that happened. Still very happy to hear your voice and uh, playing with you. Also, Quildrun, I met for so nice. I omoide o arigato. Thank you. I'm glad to hear that you had a good time. Let's just put that over there. Who needs strategy when you have physics? I know, right? Just leave it to the forces of nature and hail Mary. <laughs> hmm. Oh.
I'm not getting very good fruit right now. At least not fruit I know what to do with. Could this work? Okay, we got a Momo. Oh, no. Ah, uh, uh. Come on. Hmm. Why, why, why are the Tascarus? What, what did I do? Oh, did I, did I do the... I keep, I keep doing that without thinking. I swear, sometimes I just see the chat explode in Tascarus and I'm just like, oh god, what did I do? I don't remember. I don't remember what I did. This is a terrible board. This is an absolute mess. <laughs> Lucrece, thank you very much. I hope I'm saying that right. I just want to share some good news, though I'm still waiting for my Dream Schools audition. Uh, audition. I got my first offer today. Let's go! Love to hear that. Lapis Dragon, thank you for the 10 gifted as well. What the heck? Why is there so much generosity? I'm just playing Suika! Oh, this is so crap! I'm not even playing Suika well! It's not even going well! Ooh. That is just a line of grapes. Not touching. Ah, this is crap. Let's restart. <laughs> that wasn't even satisfying. Hmm. It's for upcoming emotional damage. I don't think there's going to be any emotional damage today. If you want to see somebody lose their mind, I don't think that you're in the right place. I don't have a goal this time. I just want to I just want to chat your ear off for a little bit while playing this game. This is my this is my way of keeping your attention. This this is my retention manipulation. I don't have subway surfers and I don't have like a bunch of slime to play with to keep your attention. So I'm playing Suika instead. <laughs> Which is by the way, the fact that people do that because they know that our attention spans have been fried so much because of short-form content is very depressing. <laughs> you got any jingly keys? Do I? No, I, I think my keys are... I think my keys are outside my booth. Uh... Oh, wait, never mind. I have these keys. Hey, hey! Remember, pay attention, don't, don't tap out, don't tap out, stay on the stream, stay on the stream. <laughs> hmm, maybe we can put that. Yes, I'm focused right now. <laughs> Why is the keys actually working? Your ch is it actually? <laughs> <laughs> no, you're pulling my leg. Surely. The keys work too well. <laughs> Maybe I should bring my keys every single time. You know how, like, they're... everyone has a different way of, like, getting their chat's attention? Maybe this should be mine. Maybe I should just be like, Hey, pay attention. I want to talk about something important. <laughs> There we go. Key ASMR. Wow, 
what are the sounds of certain things that like just work well with ASMR? Like not not keys specifically. I don't think that's like great ASMR, but like I'm trying to think of things that usually work really well. Like I know that there's like slime. Like people really like listening to slime on ASMR. Pop rocks. Oh, pop rocks. That makes sense. How would you even do that? Do you just put pop rocks in your mouth and then speak? Isn't that just, you know, those nasty mouth clicks on steroids? How many keychains do you have? Too many to count. I have so many acrylic keychains. Water sloshing around? What, like... Just, li just like this? Heartbeat? Oh yeah, heartbeat. I remember, like, uh, very early on, like, uh, around the first couple of months that I was here, I tried doing, like, a heartbeat thing with my microphone, but I don't think it worked very well. It's because, like, you, you can't really put this mic right up against things and have it work like that. I, th I think I need a different microphone for that to work properly. The 20 push-ups one? Yeah, that's the one. Any updates on the binaural microphone? It's still busted. But I, uh, I mentioned this um, a little bit earlier, like at some point, I forget when, uh, that I'm thinking of getting like a cheaper version just for the sake of having one so I can do something with it while I get the a nice fancy one sent off and replaced, if I can still do that. I feel like it should be, should be okay. Like the the guys that uh, that make the mic binaural microphone, they're really really nice. Like they're they're very like their customer service, their customer support is like it's very very good. Nothing but good stuff to say about them. I swear this is not an ad. It's just that you run into so many bad experiences with customer service sometimes. So whenever you get a nice person that just gets you exactly what what you need, it's a nice change of pace. Oh my god, another Ansamita! What the hecky? Building a rainbow, are we? <laughs> Oh, okay, it worked. Hmm. And there it is. Holy crap. The whole thing. Thank you for the rainbow spa. What the hecky. Thank you for your solar panel at Costco Ski, Mr. Eveland. Yep, did absolutely great. Seeing how many people... Hmm. Seeing how much people love you made me tear up a little bit. You're not the only one. It gets me emotional every time I see it. I'm sure your voice and your uh, songs really reach them there. Also, thank you for patiently listening to me during the one-on-one -on -one meeting. Don't worry about it. If anything, the thing that I've... Uh, if there's one thing I w wish we would have done differently, like I would have loved if there was like a... You know, like a little stage microphone that people could speak into. Because we were, um, when doing the meet and greet, uh, we had to use the webcam mic because I think that's the only microphone we had available. And if you know anything about webcam microphones, uh, they're not very, they're not known for their sound quality. And especially in like a very like loud setting, like a convention center, it can get very noisy. So it was, I was, uh, like telling everybody, like, hey, I, I, I know this is probably gonna feel a little bit awkward, but you have to shout. <laughs> You're gonna have to shout, otherwise I cannot hear you. But thankfully it worked out well for the most part. I could hear almost everybody perfectly fine. You've all, you all have very strong voices. <laughs> Deep fried children. <laughs> Webcam mics are so funny. I know! <laughs> the funny mics. Only the highest of quality here.
Ugh. Hold on, my headphones are like... I feel like I need to get a replacement he headphones because these, these are falling apart. The audio is still fine in them. They just won't sit on my head the way that they should. The only problem is that I they don't make these headphones anymore and I don't want to relearn how a different set of headphones sound. Because that makes mixing a pain. Sustaro, thank you very much. Happy New Day. Eto, omedetai no de iiniku o katte kimashita. Oh, so desu ne. Iiniku no hi mo aru desu yo ne. It's meat day. Maybe I should have some some meat today to commemorate the thing. Oh my god, ten gifted too. How generous. Thank you. Thank you for Koskoski, Aiki. Thank you, Lass. I traveled from another country to see you. Although I couldn't grab meet and greet tickets, it was still worth seeing you have fun on stage. You were amazing as always. Thank you. I'm glad people had fun. God, you have no idea what a relief it is to hear, like, directly from the people that were, were there that, like, we had fun because of all the scuff and, like, me being worried that things weren't gonna work out, okay? So it's it it's calming a lot of anxiety. <laughs> Watching the stream in 1440p because of bad signal and listening to the crunchy effect from the mic is perfect. <laughs> Thank you, Anthe. Hmm, that does sound like a pretty good match. That's the that's the early 2010s live streaming experience right there. Maybe that would be fun, doing a, uh, doing a stream in, like, 360p with uh, bad microphone quality, Windows XP background, 4x3 aspect ratio. All that jazz. POV is 2016. <laughs> 2016 still had pretty good live stream quality, didn't it? Vintage. <laughs> I don't know. Is is Windows XP considered vintage as it, at this point? I'm not sure. It's very possible that it is. I actually have no idea. Ooh, maybe this could work. Come on. Nice. Okay. Worked out a little bit better than anticipated. Yuna Ursa, thank you very much. Hi, Aiki Waiki. It's me, the person who asked if they should bring the puppet to a Miku concert. Well, update. I'm going to Japan in two days after, so expect a lot of puppet in Japan pictures. Let's go! It's always fun to see people bring the puppet everywhere. It's like a little travel buddy. Still waiting for Blue Light on Spot uh, Spotify. Manager san, please, asking for a friend. It's not up to Manager san. It's, it's a very surprisingly complicated process, but it will happen. I assure you. Let's see. Mm, no, I'm just going to drop this boy over here. Let's see. Mm -hmm. Oh, okay. Oh, this works. If the strawberry would stay in place. There you go. And then... Oh. Pfft. That did not work out as anticipated either. One, two... Okay. Okay, neat. Very neat. No, <laughs> they never stay in the same place. So can this Sweden go the Bogen itteru kirinuki karakimashita. Ah, ano kirinuki ka. Ah, so can san irashai. Welcome. <laughs> 
。あの切り抜きか。やばい。<笑>恥ずかしい。<笑> oh, no, my, my, not, not, <笑> oh, why does it have to be the, why does it have to be the swearing clips? Out of all clips, why the swearing? <laughs> I don't want people to think that I'm like, that I have sailor mouth. I swear I don't. Just get startled very easily sometimes. Wah! Oh, oh. Oh, I thought I could bonk them. I could not. Aoi san, arigatou gozaimasu. Harajuku no Ikea ni itte kimashita. Sweden no meatball, oishikatta yo. Ii na. Nice, Ikea meatballs in Harajuku. That's the Ikea that I went to. I, I, checked, I checked out to, to see what, what kind of sw Swedish imported snacks they had. And they had my favorite! They had my favorite snack. I was so happy about that. Ugh. Mm. Cheese doodles? Yeah, the cheese doodles. Good old cheese doodles. They had the exact brand and everything. I was so happy about that. So if you're ever in Harajuku and you want to have a taste of Aiki's favorite snack, then there's an Ikea right there. Ikea's every city's Swedish embassy for real. <laughs> That's a really funny way of thinking of it. The amount of apples that are not being matched right now is too darn high. It's because of my poor managens management of the small fruits. Do you want a meatball pizza? Meatball pizza is not that that bad, I'm gonna be honest. Like, it's not meatballs, as in, like, Swedish meatballs being put on pizza. It's just, like, little clumps of, like, minced meat, I believe. I think uh, there's a name for it. Like, what's it called? Is it called, like, a la carne or something? Is that what it is? Uh, What's it called? Let's see. Yeah, I think this is it. A la carne. La carne. Also known as m m meat pizza style. Yeah, that's a thing. I can see the loading screen in his eyes. I was looking at my I was looking at my phone. I was googling it to see what it was called. Oh, 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 oh no, oh, oh. Whoops, it AC. No, no, not like this. Not like this. Okay, but why though? Why the amount of strawberries? Eh, oh, that never works. I need to stop doing that. Gravity. <laughs> Gravity is not an ally of mine. Ineko san, arigatou gozaimasu. Ikea wa Christmas ni. Lucia. Lucia. Lucia matsuri o yatte iru yo. Eh? So na no? Like, if they are having, like, uh, Lucia at, uh, at an Ikea, then I 100% recommend checking it out. Good old Saint Lucy. Hmm. 
Mm. I have no idea what's going on right now. Yushia Matsuri te nani? Um, it's basically a celebration that usually... I think it's on the 13th of December. Where they have like... And this is sort of Swedish Christmas festivity. It's called like uh, St. Lucy's Day. Where they... There's a bunch of people, uh, boys and girls alike, dress up in like white gowns. And they all have like a little candle in their hand. Uh, usually when children do it, they also have, they dress up as tiny little Santas and gingerbread people. And then they just, uh, they walk in. St. Lucy has like a crown of candles. And then they sing a bunch of uh, songs that re relate to, to Christmas. It's like a little bit of a tradition thing. Ah, oh, dang. Ah, oh well. I saw it in Danish school. Yeah, yeah, it, it's in uh, other Scandinavian countries as well. Mikey Keys, I'm getting distracted. You got it. Hey. Remember, eyes on the price. Eyes on the price. Come on. VTuber on the screen. VTuber on the screen. Pay attention. <laughs> All my family did for Christmas was eat, drink, and party. I mean, that's valid, too. Some people like to celebrate like that. God, I'm hungry. I haven't had anything since breakfast. I also need to go to the grocery store. My my pantry is embarrassingly bare. I feel like if you opened open my pantry, there would be like dust like dust bunnies just like jumping out of there. Just like pure <laughs> Ayami-san, thank you very much for the 10 gifted. That's so nice of you. So much generosity today. I can't, I'm having a hard time believing it. Staring at fruits isn't helping either. I do have apples. Maybe I, I'll, I'll go get an apple. One second. I'm getting an apple. I return. I haven't had an apple in a while. Okay, let's do this. This is not going as well as I thought it would. Mmm. <laughs> no, oh, that's the good stuff. Okay, let's see if I can get get a better crunch. I want to get a real good sound.
Mm -mm -mm. It's so sour. It makes my face all scrunchy. Mm -mm -mm. Kind of apple? It's a green one. I like green apples. I'm a green apple kind of boy. Mention meatball pizza. I could do you know meatball sushi. I've had it once at Kura Sushi. I did not know that there is meatball. I know meat sushi is a thing. Uh, but I've never seen meatball sushi. But meat sushi was good. So, I mean, I'm open to it. If it's good, it's good. I remember when we went to a, a, a karaoke place in Japan and on the menu that you could order in food like there was like meat sushi so we got like a platter of various types of meat sushi it's pretty good uh Mm. Sorry, I didn't mean for this to turn into an eating stream. <laughs> I just want to finish the apple before it gets nasty, you know? Mm. Mmm. It's always something in between these guys. Do a full apple eating stream. <laughs> really? Is that where we're at right now? <laughs> apple eating stream. <laughs> That's when you know that you've run out of ideas. What do I do? Eat an apple. Okay. <laughs> Please get those strawberries together. Come on. Come on. There you go. Yeah? Nice. Dang it. How many apples do you need to eat? I don't know. It have to be like some somewhat of an impressive number at the very least to make it entertaining. Realistically, like how many apples could you eat? before you start like getting too full because i've i've never eaten more than like maybe one or two apples at once never have i eaten more apples than that 3 really only 3 i feel like it would be more Like, if you were to challenge yourself to eat apples and only apples until you're so full that you can't eat anymore. It should have been more. More than three. Like I'm thinking at least like ten or something. How big is the apple? I don't know, like a fist? That's usually how they are, right? Let's conduct an experiment. De I, I was joking about like the, the apple eating stream, but now you guys got me intrigued. 
I don't like that I'm considering... <laughs> that I'm considering an apple-eating stream. <laughs> is this... Is this what my time in Niji Sanji has come to? Ike, eat the apple. <laughs> eat the apple, it's content. Come on. Yes, yes. Man, it would be so awesome right now if a cherry just decided to show up. Damn. I'm Oh, 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 oh. Oh, oh. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Maybe? I'm just gonna leave it like this for a bit and hope that something moves. Let's see, Gina, thank you very much. I'm so glad I got to see you at CCSK. Oh, Koskoski, I'm stupid. You were so very cute when speaking Thai. I'm, I'm, I'm glad. I, I've, I had no idea what I was doing. And I really liked you singing Blue Light so much. You sing very well. I'm proud of you. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> Do you remember that? Why are they not moving? Payment for the apple. Really? You don't need to pay for my apples. Uh No, of course it doesn't work. Ugh. Well, I'm th th those momos are ju just going to have to remain separated, it seems. Da -da 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 -da. Oh, actually, I don't have no, no idea what's going on. Apple fund. Green for apples. <laughs> okay, let's move away from the apples. I was, I was mostly joking when I said that. God, those Momos really don't want to touch, do they? I am not helping at all with my... Oh, never mind. <laughs> I spoke too soon. <laughs> eh. No. Not like this. Oh. Hmm. All right. If it works, it works. Brrr. Come on, it costs nothing to be nice to me. Please, fruit. What is what is going on? I'm all over the place. Uh I feel like this would be better to do. Maybe. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yep, 
Yay! There we go. Being nice to you, Fee. Roku, I... <laughs> Are you perhaps Snow White? Koshitan? No, I am not. But thank you. What is going on here? Maybe you can pay the game to be nicer to you, but I already paid for it. Melon! Got a melon. Ah. Here we go. Ow. You guys don't hear me chewing, right? That would be disgusting. If you can, I'm really sorry. No? Okay, thank goodness. Okay, good. Thank goodness. <laughs> No, don't fall there. Ooh, a cherry. When I actually need it. I don't think I'm ever getting that pair, though. Greetings, Freehead Eveland. It seems your gaming today has been quite fruitful, sire. I wish you the best in your endeavors to conquer the watermelon. My man has really written a super chat in cursive. <laughs> Thank you. Your, your, your vocabulary is intimidating. I respect it. Go down! There you go, down. That did not go well. Okay, well, maybe, maybe the, if this worked. Perhaps, perchance. There we go. Hmm. Bro cooked and made the fruitiest fruit salad? I don't know, man. I feel like the one that makes the best fruit salad is <laughs> Zally. He, he is the, the resident fruit king of Niji EN right now. See, okay, I've almost made my way around the entire apple. Just need like one, one more big bite. Neat. That was a good crunch right there. Good stuff. Didn't quite work out the way I wanted it to, but it's okay. There you go. 
was hoping that would go all the way down. Ah, oh, damn it. <laughs> I should have known. I'm so tired. I just want to sleep. And sleep! If you're tired, you should sleep. I know that's mighty rich coming from me. If you're tired, go get yourself some sleep. You've earned it. Like, eh? Oh, <laughs> sure, that works too. Fancy, I thank you very much for the apples. And... Well, see, I thank you for the five gifted. The generosity train just keeps going. It's nice, though. It's like... It's like a wave of positivity. Everybody being in good mood. Giving out the gifteds, a bunch of people are getting their first membership, so everybody can use those funnel emotes. Check out some of the members' content. We like to have fun there. There's mix breakdowns. There's watch-alongs. There's uh, free chats where we talk about things that we usually don't talk about during the public free chats. A bunch of stuff like that. Oh, and there's also a members' exclusive cover. So if your name turns green, feel free to peruse through. Have fun with it. Ooh. Uh, okay, this works. Boom, 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 boom. Nice. Oh, I really wish those would slide down. Yoko, what the heck? You? Thank you. Thank you for the 10 gifted. Alina, thank you very much. Hey, Aki, damn girl, if you were a fruit, you'd be a fine apple. Are you a lemon? Because you make me want to pucker up. Are you a banana? Because I find you very appealing. Stop. <laughs> Seize this, please. Anya, thank you for the ding gifted. What the heck? I'm not even playing the witness. Why are there so many gifted? Come on. Nice. There is three Momos on screen. Uh, I'm a mess. <laughs> The moments are so cute, though. I know. I love that face. That face is so good. I, find that, yeah, I love all of the faces, except for this cherry one. They're all so funny. Dana, thank you very much. And Ichi, thank you very much for the gifted. Mm. Niji Sanji, let's go. No, there's no need for that. Like the keys. Okay, we're not. <laughs> Let's not run their joke into the ground. Ah! That's alright. I do not like this cherry. Its smug aura mocks me. <laughs> yes, exactly.
get some, get an apple over there. Neat. I wonder if it's possible to win. I don't think you win in this game. It's just you just get as high of a score as you possibly can. Score attack, basically. I'm trying to make like a staircase of fruit here. Ooh, come on. A? No. <laughs> yes. How did you roll in that direction? Go push them together. There. It's a little cherry over there, but that's usually not a big deal. Really clean so far? Yeah, I'm, I'm kind of surprised. I'm not gonna lie. But I'm gonna ruin it right now. Here we go. It was fun while it lasted. Maybe I can clean it up, but unlikely. Uh, it still looks pretty all right. Nice peach, Ike. Thanks. Apparently, Suika is similar enough to Tetris for people who are, who are good at te uh, those to also be good at this. I mean, I can I can see it. They're both puzzle games that where you drop things from up above. Imokororin-san, thank you very much for the five gifted. I was actually watching like some Tetris videos the other day, and there was this one guy. Uh, it's a video that's a couple of years old, but. He was playing Tetris 99, and he was specifically placing the blocks along to the music. Like, he was making a beat with his block placements. Like, how cracked do you gotta be at a game to literally play Tetris like a rhythm game? Oh, nice, it worked. I'm, I'm kind of surprised that it did. Mm. I wanted you to push that down. Ooh, maybe? Yay, it worked, but now it got blocked off in the middle, so maybe it wasn't so good after all. Mm -mm -mm. Good luck, apples. You can have mini suikas. Thank you, Tsuki. I'm just having this of something in the background. And we we just have a, have ourselves a little bit of a chill stream. No heated Suka gameplay today. The heated Suka gameplay, that comes later. That comes later in the tournament, so you better tune in. And see the exciting conclusion to everything. Mm -hmm. 
Oh, okay, that worked out. There's a version of Tetris called Tetris Effect that has musical elements. It also has VR. Thank you, Roku. And yes, I'm I'm aware of Tetris Effect. The only problem is YouTube hates Tetris Effect. I don't mean YouTube as in like, like it's like you're not allowed to stream it or anything. It's that Tetris Effect has a lot of, you know, effects in it. And a lot of those are particle effects. Like, it kind of looks like sparkles, confetti, and fireworks, and all that stuff. And the YouTube uh, uh, bitrate hates that stuff. It makes the quality take such a nosedive. If you don't believe me, look up any gameplay of Tetris Effect and you'll see exactly what I mean. There's even a Tom Scott video about it. About why confetti and snow look so terrible on YouTube. So even though Tetris Effect is like super, super pretty for the person playing it on YouTube, a lot of that goes out the window. Tom Scott mentioned! Could you, could you imagine <laughs> if one day Tom Scott uploads a video like, I'm right here at Niji Sanji EN about to eat some of the livers. <laughs> that, that would be the crossover of the century. I have no idea where to put this cherry. This stupid, stupid, dumb cherry. That accent. <laughs> I don't know how to do accents. Which is why I ch tend to make them as ridiculous as I possibly can. So nobody will confuse it for a genuine attempt. Dang it! Can you sneak in under that? I guess you can't. Ooh, maybe you can. Oh, hey. That worked out better than anticipated, too. It reminds me of the <laughs> video of Tom eating a microphone. Dude, I was crying at that. I was laughing so hard. He just goes, like, My voice is slain! And then he just eats the microphone for no reason. <laughs> like, it's so dumb. <laughs> Metsa ni teru. <laughs> Thank you, I think. <sighs> Intrusive thoughts one, Tom's got zero. <laughs> Kind of makes me curious. Do you guys have any any experience like where you've had an intrusive thought that just that just won over you? I don't think I have too many of those, except for one. There's one time that I remember very vividly where I did something very stupid just because just because I could. At the expense of a kid. <laughs> At the expense of a kid in a grocery store. He was just like talking to somebody and he said something in a very loud voice and I overheard it as I passed him. And my intrusive thought just told me like, turn towards him and say this. And I did. The, like at the instant the thought popped into my head. I just turned towards him and towards him and I said something and it was really dumb and really bad and Loki kind of rude. I still think about it to this day. I'm like, why did I do that? That was so dumb. What did you say? It was pretty bad. I don't I don't want to repeat it. It wasn't very nice. I don't I have no no valid reason to say what I did. It was just it was just so unprovoked. 
intrusive doesn't doesn't mean impulsive. I mean, I, I feel like they're in the same ballpark at least. Throws hand with a thirteen year old. Like nobody threw hands. I just said it, and he just looked back at me in confusion. And then I just kept walking, and I've never seen him again. How gap bad can it be? <sighs> I guess it's not that bad, but it's still like, you shouldn't say that to someone. <laughs> it's like, it's just kind of like a WTF kind of statement. What were you thinking? I wasn't. Exactly. Is it a curse word? No, it's not a curse word or anything. It's not a bad word. It was. It's just a dumb, weird, kind of gross, <laughs> like, sentence. But I shall not elaborate any further, because I do not wish to do so. What if you wanted to go to heaven, but God said, Remember this, kid? <laughs> Remember what you did to this one, kid? Remember when you told him something very unprovoked and stupid and kind of mean? <laughs> oh, quick crap. Sorry about that, big G, man. In my defense, it was kind of funny. <laughs> May, wh who knows, maybe I'm lucky and the big G-man goes, Yeah, you know what, man, it kind of was! Come on in! What the heck am I talking about? What is this stream? Why are you like this, Aiki? I don't know. <laughs> There's many things that I say and do that I don't have much of an explanation for. But I've just come to accept this as part of... Part of what it is like to be me. <laughs> I've never heard him described as the big G-man before. <laughs> really? <laughs> I feel like everybody... <laughs> I feel like that that's one of the more common, like, funny ways of referring to God. The big G- and the big G-man. The man upstairs. The one calling the shots. I look over at chat and I just see somebody say Sky Daddy. I hate that. That is the worst one. That objectively the worst one. Like if you think that you could think if if you have just the idea that I think I could think of something worse, know that you cannot. That is the worst one. <laughs> I didn't see what that was. <laughs> I didn't see- I didn't see who logged in. <laughs> the chat was in the way. I don't know who that was. Let's see. Yus, thank you very much. Hello, Ike. You just ate an apple, right? So now you're- Looks like you're the apple of my eye. Tsunami, Kyoa, E. Niku no Hina no de, Sweden, Ni, Yaki Niku ga, Aru no ka, Kininanimas. Happy Niak Day. Thank you very much. I have never seen a Yaki Niku place in Sweden, ever. A proper, like, actual Yaki Niku place? Never. I have never seen it. If, the, if it exists, I am not aware of it.
えないのないですシスターカロラブアキカミングバイアニソーダーライクアジアンクジーンスウィーデンイズノッティーゼースティングヨーファインサムヴェッドバイキジャパニーズクジーンインスペシフィックアドデンスウシーユーノッリリギナファインマッチヴェッドバイキダーメンプレイスズアルバイキフューエンファーバトゥーンバイキクレイゼー Yaki Niku, I've never seen once. No bento? Never seen a bento. Good ramen does exist, just go to Sin Damen in Stockholm. But yeah, not, mu not much other stuff. Ah, I see. I haven't really found any food places in in Stockholm per se. Well, any food places that specialize in any sort of cuisine of Asian descent. Usually you just find a place that is just like do that does like a bunch of different things. Rather than like a restaurant specializing in a specific type of food, if that makes sense. I don't know. I feel like I'm rambling at this point. I have no idea what I'm saying. <laughs> oh, dang it. That sucks. I'm gonna YOLO this. Ah, I got two trigger happy. No JP food subscription? No, absolutely not. I've never heard of that. If it exists, then it's beyond my knowledge. I heard that Sundsvall has the be best sushi in Sweden. Really? Sundsvall of all places? Dong Dong Joy, thank you very much. Nothing but a bunch of moos. Moo 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 moo. Suika brings out the most random and conversation topics, but isn't that what's so good about it? Hmm. We love Suica game for that. <laughs> it's the Suica buff. It's the gives a weirdness buff to the conversational topics. Ugh. Where do I put this? Just chill and random conversation. Yeah, more or less. <laughs> I'm knocking this little thing back and forth. There we go. I've been sort of revisiting like old. Anime openings that I grew up listening to. And while I was going through, like, I, th I think I went through some of the Bleach ones, the really early Bleach ones. And then I came across the openings for Hikaru no Go. And I forgot what bangers they are. Like, if you want, like, some, like, very 90s, like, early 2000s uh, J pop. Then look up the openings for、um, Hikaru no Go. Both the first and second ones. They're both really good. Hikaru no Go, I grew up with that based. Hikaru no Go is so good. It's probably my favorite quote unquote sports anime. I know, I know that when people think sports, it's usually more athletic stuff, but I feel like it counts.
Such a good anime, though. Yeah! Such a good one. I think I've watched it, like, three times or so. I've watched it twice in Japanese and once in English. I don't know if they... I, did they finish the, finish the English dub? I feel like they did. It just took a really long time before they did. What's it about? It's about a guy named Hikaru that finds a a Go board, which is a Japanese board game. And there's a spirit trapped in the Go board called Fujiwara no Sai. Or just Sai for short. And uh, yeah, Sai is one of the greatest Go players of all time. And then they embark on a journey to become the greatest Go player ever. What's your, what's your take on the English dub? It's very early 2000s. It's when most of, back when most of the Japanese, or Japanese media dubs were sort of done in, I think it was done in Canada? Because I know Brad Swale is in it. Brad Swale is Fujiwara no Sai. And I think Brad Swale is, I, I like him as Sai. He's funny. And there's a, there's a few good casts in there. Was by Ocean Group then? Yeah, Ocean, that seems about right. Let's see, where do we put this? Over here. Have you watched any other sports anime? I feel like I have. I watched, I watched the first season of Yowamushi Pedal. That counts as sports, right? Okay, it counts. Thank God. <laughs> So I, uh, Aiki can play Go. I, I, I can play a little bit because they had like uh, Go lessons at the end of uh, every volume in the manga, and they also had Go uh, Go lessons at the end of every episode in Hikaru no Go. It was like at the, at the very end, you would hear that everybody go 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 Igo, and then they would teach you a little bit about Go. So I can play a little bit. I'm very bad. I don't know all the rules, but a little bit. Going back to the to the dub, uh, another really good cast. Uh, whoever they cast for, what was his name? Like Yuki, Yuki Kun. Usually, it's very hard to like cast like young boys in uh, in English dubs because they I either sound like uh, Yuki Mitani, yeah, Mitani Yuki Kun. Usually, they sound either too old or they sound like too young, like, if it's, um, if it's a woman doing the voice, but whoever they cast for Yuki was, I think it was a really good cast. I think he has a good English voice. Not everybody in the cast is a slam dunk, but that, that's what happens. I think it's a decent way of experiencing the show. Let's see, other sports anime. Hmm... I don't, I don't, I don't, I'm not super, super, like, into sports animes, really. I haven't watched many of them. I know that some, some people are, like, crazy about them. I know, like, people are, like, very gung-ho about Haikyuu, but I've never seen a single millisecond of Haikyuu. Kudobot? Nope. Blue Lock? Nope. Yuri on Ice? Nope. Free? Nope. Slam Dunk? Nope.
Skate the Infinity. Okay, I have seen a little bit of Skate the Infinity. I'm, I'm, I'm telling you, like, I've, I've not been crazy about sports animes. Bochi the Rock? No, I have not watched Bochi. I feel like I should, though. Because I, I grew up with K-On. And I love K-On, so I feel like I should watch Bochi. Hmm. Bochi is uh, cute and good. I mean, that's all you really need, right? <laughs> you just need music and wholesomeness. That's all you need, right? I mean, when I think back to K-On, like, even though it's, like, supposed to be, like, an anime about, you know, like, the light music club, I think they only play, like, two songs in the show. <laughs> but that's not what you're there for. You're there for the day-to-day -day shenanigans. Like, it's a slice-of-life kind of deal. It's just a- it's just a comfy show. God, I gotta finish my apple before it starts going nasty. I don't know if anybody uses this term anymore. But like, back in the day, in the late 2000s, early 2010s, uh, in the West, we call with slice of life shows. There were certain ones we just referred to as shows. We just referred to them as cute girls doing cute things. There was like no plot. There was no overarching story. Like no big stakes or anything. It was just cute girls doing cute things. That that was like a genre of show at the time. People still use there's an <laughs> there's an acronym for it. C G D C T. Cute girls doing cute things. I did not know that was an acronym. <laughs> is there any cute boys doing cute things though? I would watch the heck out of that. Oh yeah, there is. Absolutely. I don't know if I would call it cute, though. Like, there's one show I'm thinking of where I'm like, would I call it cute? Because there's a lot of cursed things that happen in that show. Drop the name. Name now. I think, I feel like you guys know it. I feel like you guys know it. Yeah, you guys know it. It's Dancy Koko Sei no Nichijo. Come on, get those apples to touch. What anime is that? Oh, if you've not seen it, then uh, <laughs> give it a watch. <laughs> it's a fun time, I assure you. I meant to do all of that. A lot of people that are familiar with Dansi Kokose. It's a good show, it's fun. Plus it has Tomokazu Sugita in it. And Sugita-san is always a win in my book. If Sugita-san is, is in a show, then odds are I'm gonna give it a chance.
since you uh, like Slice of Life, have you watched Little Busters? No. It's because, like, when Little Busters first aired, that's when I was, like, really, like, like, diving into visual novels. Like, that's when I read the most visual novels, and I wanted to read the VN instead, but I never got around to it. So I don't- I, I know very, very little about it. All I know is that the, uh, somebody I knew had this one character that was their Oshi that they would, like, save copious amounts of images on. It was like one of the- it was one of the short ones. I think her name was like Cud or something. Like K-U-D. I think- think that- that's her name? Is it Cud or Could? I don't know. The white hair girl? I think she had white hair. I don't remember. It's been so long. I'm just noticing that I'm, like, doing drops right now and not even looking where I'm putting the fruit. I feel like I should pr probably do that. Oh, everything is going straight to heck. None of this is what I need, man. Okay, a little lower. There you go. A little lower. There you go. Uh, no, no, <laughs> not like that, not like this. Oh, now what to do? Oh, that didn't work either. Oh well, I must accept my fate of having my pineapples divided. Oh, maybe, maybe, maybe it works. Maybe, I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. Maybe something interesting will happen. Maybe. Ooh. No, probably not. I feel like I should give up the dream there. The pain apple. <laughs> That's good. I like that. God, this is such a mess. Ugh. I'm gonna have another sip of water. Fukumenke noise. I liked it. Just felt like it didn't go anywhere. I assume that it keeps going in the manga. I just watched what was out at the time. And... I, I like the premise. I like the, the sort of hook of the show. But then it just sort of went nowhere. <laughs> Oh, wait, never mind. It works. Kind of. Can we keep going with this? Probably not. Mm. No way I'm tensing up so much. My poor neck is so stiff. Ugh. Ugh. Is today a good voice day? I don't know, is it? <coughs> kind of. At least for whistle register. <laughs> oh, 
that wasn't very good. Maybe... maybe. <laughs> nice. It worked out in the end. Okay, now... Now those Momos just gotta... They just gotta find each other. Somehow. How they're gonna go about that... Oh, God knows. Oh, God. <laughs> the entire thing just sort of like went like whoop, whoop. <laughs> up and down. Ike is getting questionable looks from my co workers. What are you looking at, huh? Never seen a 2D person before? <laughs> Watch me just get people into trouble at their workplace. So you brought you brought in a two-dimensional dude that proceeded to insult staff. I'm gonna have to report this to HR. <laughs> Neat. Where the heck do I put this? Mm. Oh, please. Oh, dang. I'm getting everything except what I really need right now. There we go. Okay, let's see if this works. Oh, never mind. <laughs> I didn't have enough enough fruits lined up. I thought I did. I was mistaken. Oh, that can that can still work. Kind of. Okay, what about now? No. Ah, too much pressure. Oh, 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 oh. Calculated. Mm. You cooked. Apparently, I did. Not entirely sure how, but I did. Reward myself with a little bit of apple there. Mm -hmm. I cooked without thinking. <laughs> the best way to cook. It's one of the main reasons why cooking something extravagant isn't very appealing to me. Because if I got to spell, spend like two hours preparing a meal that I only get to enjoy for like. Seven minutes? That's kind of a rip-off. If someone else is preparing the meal, then- and I don't have to worry about it, then that's a different story. But if I'm gonna be the one to do it, and I only get to know enjoy it for, like, a little while, then I'm just like, eh. It's not really worth it. I'd rather make something that takes less time. But hey, that's just me. You eat so fast, like, is, isn't that a guy thing? Isn't dudes fast when they eat? Is it? Like, or is it just me? Am I just a dude that inhales food? No? Okay. <laughs> Shows how much I know. <laughs> Dang it! 
I like eating Kirby style and just like <gasps> inhale the whole thing. I never heard of it being a guy thing. Okay, I guess it's not then. Oh well. Shows how much I know. Cooking for someone else is cute though. Yeah, to see the problem with that is in order to do that, you gotta have you gotta have somebody in your life that you can cook for. The secret sauce is emotional conflict. That is an amazing sentence. <laughs> Invite someone? I could. But it's like... I don't know. I guess I've never heard of any Swede, like... Inviting their friends over. At least, like, the kind of dynamic I have with my IRL friends. is kind of like... If one of them asks, like, Hey Ike, wanna come over? We're cooking. I'm gonna be like, all right, well, that's weird. Like, what what what's going on? Do you do you need something? Like, if you want anything, just just say so. Why? I don't know. It's just not something we do. And I feel like they would feel the same if I just said like, "Hey, come over, I'm cooking." They would just kind of be like, "What? What are you talking about, Ike?" Like sure, like we'll 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 hang out and like and have ourselves a drink and like order food, but for the specific purpose of just like I want to cook for you guys, it just I don't know. It just, we just I guess we just don't have that dynamic with each other. I'm sure it exists in Sweden. This is just like with us in particular. Culture shock, I guess. Maybe maybe it's a culture thing. Could be, could not. I, I, I don't know. Yay, Momo! No dinner party? Dinner parties are a thing, but it's more like a family... ...kind of thing. You, you, you it's, usually don't, like, invite friends over for that. At least not very often. I think I got, like, invited over, like, by... ...by some... by, like, by a different family, like, once. For like homemade tacos. That was about it. That's the one thing I can think of off the top of my head. Ooh, and then then we do the other side and we'll have it be symmetrical. Maybe. Come on. Nice. Oh, come on, please. I'm so mad. That's actually so frustrating. <laughs> no, don't do that. Oh, there we go. Worked out in the end. How about sleepovers? Maybe when I was younger. I had a, quite a few sleepovers with friends when I was younger. When we would like stay up late, watch movies, play video games well into the night. Good times. Like I specifically remember one time when I was sleeping over at our friend's place. And we set up uh, two computers and we played Age of Mythology against each other for God knows how many hours. It's like a spin-off of Age of Empires. It's like a real-time strategy game. Good times. 
I think Age of Mythology is on Steam, actually. So if I'm feeling nostalgic, I could just buy that. Age of Mythology based. Hey! Fellow Age of Mythology enjoyer. It's like the only RTS I've ever gotten into. I never got into like Warcraft. I never got into Starcraft. I never got into a Age of Empires. I did play... What was it called? Cusacks? Back to War? Or something along those lines. Age of Mythology was my favorite one. Same. I mean, it's the only one that I like properly put proper time into. I tried playing Warcraft 3, but I couldn't... I don't know. It didn't grab me the same way. Which civilization do you enjoy playing? I've never played Civ. I never got into it. I haven't played a whole lot of strategy games in my day. It's only a few. Age of Mythology was one of them. Have you ever played Roller Coaster Tycoon 3? Yes. Played ungodly amounts of that. Roller Co Coaster Tycoon and Zoo Tycoon, I put a ungodly amount of hours into. <laughs> Age of Mythologies was released 21 years ago. Is it that old? Wow. I played it way later then. Jesus. The fact that it still worked is kind of amazing in that case. Wait, wait, wait. Oh. Oh gosh, what is going on? What am I doing? Oh, please, come on! Oh, you have gotta be kidding! <laughs> oh, there we go. Okay. We at least got a pineapple. I'll take that. We take those. Are you gonna continue the funny Android game? Yes! Yes, I am! I don't know which day this week, but one day this week. Let's see. I don't know what day will be which... which thingy this week. But, uh, I've written out, like, don't scream for tomorrow because I want to see what that's all about. Uh, then the day after that, I'm gonna be playing with Wilson. Then on Saturday, in honor of Shu Yamino, I'm playing Frog Detective, and on Sunday, I haven't figured it out yet. That might be when we do, like, the work stream or something. I don't know. Let me just nestle that in there. Ooh, that worked out a lot better than expected. <laughs> For anybody that mentions Bug Fables, I looked up how long Bug Fables is. Bug Fables is like 30 to 40 hours. And I don't know if I'm ready to pick up another game that is that length. At least not right now. I want to finish up a few games before I consider that. But Dopia Will said, I'll play it on my own time. Apparently it's on Switch. So if I'm ever traveling again, then I can put it on Switch and indulge myself in the bug fables. Okay. 
Okay. Doing, do, doing all right. Never mind. It's not what I wanted. Dang it. Hmm. What about Funny Barista Ike? Oh, that's coming back too. We're gonna wrap that up too. There's a lot of ongoing games at the moment. I'm gonna try and finishing some of them. Momo! Come on! Ah! That's still in the game! Confirmed! Uh. <laughs> Why? Why is that a thing? <laughs> mm. <sighs> oh wow, that is a big super. Hold on. Let me just read the one that was before it first. Um, yeah, thank you very much. Hey, I managed to sneak a little drawing of Quilfloof into my art university final project. <laughs> if my lecturer asked, it was my inspiration. Oh, <laughs> that's neat. I'm kind of curious how, how you sn snuck it in now. And Haruka-san, thank you very much. Eto, konbanwa, Aiku-kun. Eto, konna samui hi de haishin ga mirete uresi desu. Gamba, gamba. Eto, Yomenaktemoi. Oh, okay. Done. Thank you for sharing and thank you for the super chat. Sorry that it took me a while to read that. It's just like t reading kanji takes me longer. <laughs> there we go. It's not that I have a problem reading kanji or anything. If anything, it's good practice. It's just that. I gotta use more of my brain power. <laughs> hmm. How long have we been going? Two and a half? Let's keep going for a bit longer. Oh, just gotta sit better. Not I can never find a comfortable way to sit. I'm always constantly changing my position into something progressively more ridiculous. Because posture is a meme. Chain chair and chair. Chairs. Why why can I not say that ch change chairs? That that's hard to say. Change Change, change, why? Why can I not say this? Change chairs. Change chairs. Why is that hard to say? Change chairs. And I will once this completely dies on me. It does a little bit. Sea se she sells seashells by the seashore. What's wrong with your current chair? There's nothing wrong with it. It's just very well worn. It's seen it's seen a lot of use. I think I've had it for 
How many years? I think I got it like maybe like four, four or five years ago. Before that, I sat on like a really terrible chair, like a wooden one. Made my bum hurt a lot. Oh, here come the tiny ones. What do you want from me? Come on. Dang it. Let's see. Fair, I sit on a dining chair, so yeah, you work with what you got. I would rather floor gang than sit in an uncomfy chair. I mean, I don't really have the option to do that. At least, I don't want to move all my stuff onto the floor. <laughs> And also, in my booth, I can't really, like, you know, sit on the floor. I mean, if I really wanted to, I'm sure I could think of a setup that worked for that, but... It's not built for that. I'd rather use it... Use it as it was intended to be used. Ooh. Nice. Neat. Cool and good, if you will. Oh! I thought he was gonna, like, jump over that little cherry. That would have been very neat. Ooh! Uh, it's almost there. There we go. Got it eventually. Hmm. Oh. All right. Uh, now what? Ah, dang. Keep goofing. Keep goofing it up. Okay, nice. It's actually going pretty well so far. It's not so bad. Yeah, it's pretty... It's pretty alright. Hmm... Maybe here? I don't know. Just had to wait for that to slide all the way down. Hmm... Come on. Down you go. There. Okay, two cherries. That works too. Neat. Hmm. It just keeps going. They don't stop coming. Oh no. That did not. Oh no! Oh, that was so close. Uh, okay. How do we do this in a way that works? Oh, nope. Okay. Hmm.
We were doing so well. And now we get a bunch of fruits we don't need. That are gonna get in the way and all that jazz. Oh well. Let's just have fun with it. Hmm. I will never understand the physics of this game. I don't think anybody does. The physics have a mind of their own. Come on. Nice. And... Nice. It's about... Yeah. Okay. Oh, and they didn't roll in the same direction. Oh, well. Fruits drop, roll, then fly. Yes. Is that... Is that enough to push it down? No, I guess not. Oh, oh, never mind. I spoke too soon. Oh, no! Why would you do... Why would you go there? Oh, and then... Then the apple forsakes me, too. Could this still be saved, maybe? Probably not. Oh, well. You win some, you lose some. Mm -hmm. It's because you ate it earlier, the apple wants revenge. Oh my god, probably. You're right. It all makes sense now. Oh my god, my, my frames are dying. Now eat another one. I do have three left, so I could technically go for another apple. But I feel like that would be overkill. <laughs> ah, dang. I had faith. Okay. Uh. Hmm. Hmm. I don't know. <laughs> it's probably over, but that's okay. Pineapple touch, please. I don't think it's going to. <sighs> and even after eating that apple, I'm still hungry. I should get some food after this. Mmm. Ah, that's it. Oh well. Let's see, Lucia, thank you very much. Hey, I keep. I re uh, remembered I have something else to say. Happy Nyike Day. Also, when you sang Blue Like, I uh, heard you sing Blue Like at Costco Ski, I felt it from the bottom of my heart. Thank you. Thank you very much. That's very nice of you. All right. Let's see, that was like almost three hours of Suika. I feel like that's pretty alright just for like a chill Suika stream for the sake of just playing and talking. <laughs> There's a, quite a few super chats that I haven't read. So I feel like we should take care of those. 
while we can continue to chat a little bit. So let me just prep something real quick. Like so, and let's hop over here. There we go. Oh yeah. <laughs> that was fun. Mm. Yay, room time! Room time! Okay, let's get some text on the screen like so. Like that. Would you put on cat ears for uh, for us? I, I don't have them on hand right now. Unfortunately. Sorry. <laughs> Done! Thank you very much. Thank you for playing this Su Suika game, Otsaiki. Thank you! I'm sorry I don't have the cat ears on hand. My bad. I think I don't think I do. Let me check. Uh, let's see. No. No, I do not. Sorry. <laughs> eh. Okay, let's scroll back to the beginning. God, there were so many supas this stream. What the hecky? Oh, no. Oh, I'm gonna have to do it old school. Dang, my, my extension just ate. All of the freaking supas. So we're gonna have to do this old school style. Using YouTube Studio. Here we go. And da -da 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 -da. YouTube Studio. In a bad way? It's just it's just jank. It's janky. It's gotten better though. They've updated it, so it's a, like way more easy to use now. It also doesn't lag as much, which is which is awesome. Here, let's see, where is it, where is it? There we go, okay, there's the first one. Okay. God, wow, why am I so hungry? I, I ate an apple and everything. <laughs> Excuse me. Let me get a comfortable sitting position. Because apparently that's Mission Impossible. Time to eat and <laughs> test that amount of apple. Hmm. <laughs> Stop saying how hungry. <laughs> how hungry. <laughs> it's so stupid. I feel like eating triggers hunger. I, I mean, I guess that's true. Jesse, Jesse, we need to cook. Oh my god, speaking of, have you guys seen that one trailer for Persona 3 Reload where they <laughs> they edited Walter White into and like as a character trailer and it's done like almost perfectly seamlessly. And at one point he even goes like Junpei, we have to cook and they're in a kitchen. Okay, good. I'm not the only one that has seen it. Perfect. Breaking Bad editors or something else. <laughs> they really are. Oh my god, my poor headphones are falling apart. Okay, starting from the beginning, let's see what we got here. Kanata, thank you very much. First as always. Uh, Kawane, thank you very much. Metamomon, thank you very much. That's my bro, Watermelon. <laughs> Watermelon, that's nice. Rova, thank you very much. Happy Nyike Day. The thumbnail of Watermelon is a masterpiece. <laughs> thanks. You can thank Aikaso for that one. And thanks for Blue Light uh, Live in the event. It was amazing. You did so well. Thank you. I tried my best. Melinda, thank you very much. Ciro, thank you very much. Uh, Vio, thank you very much. Let's see. Good morning, Ike. I had surgery yesterday, so I'm kind of still recovering, but your streams helped me, uh, helped me stay calm during everything. Thank you. I'm glad, uh, hopefully the surgery went well since you're here and like su and like sending a message. Uh, I assume that it went well, so I'm super happy to hear that. I wish you a speedy recovery and hope that you're back to 100% as soon as possible. Let's see. Uh, Yoko, thank you very much. Uh, Fei, thank you very much. Hachiwashi Hachisan, thank you very much once again for the Rainbow Supa. It was super, super nice of you. Uh, 
Narisara, thank you very much. Uh, Yoko again, thank you very much. Salty Molly, thank you very much. Let's see, Vex, thank you very much. Hello, Ike, it was nice uh, to meet you and have a meeting greet during Koskoski. Uh, I uh, told you the way to enjoy Samyang uh, instead of Bulldog. <laughs> thank you so much for uh, everything. Thank you very much. Yeah, Samyang has a bunch of different noodles, don't they? Samyang has, like, more than just spicy noodles. Because, like, the regular beef noodles that I get, like, they're also Samyang. Like, sometimes when I'm, like, too lazy and I just want to have, like, a, like, beef and, like, like, beef instant noodles, those are Sam Samyang ones. Samyang is, like, one of those comp companies that, like, do everything. Like, they also do, le like, lenses. I know Samyang lenses are a thing. Like, camera lenses. How you go from, like, instant noodles to camera lenses? I don't know, but there's just, like, certain companies that do that. That just do everything. I mean, yay for diversification, I guess. Mmm... Let's see, uh, moving on. Zenny, thank you very much. Uh, Kizu, thank you very much. Nirin, thank you very much. Got a chance to talk with a lot of Quildren while waiting for your meet and greet. They're so lovely. Thanks again for the story about Lolita and your hard working. Thank you very much. Uh, let's see, Kyo, thank you very much. Uh, Lapis Dragon, thank you very much. What a timing to have my Neko Luxium plushies arrive on Nyike Day. The Neko Ike puppet was the only one being strong in the plastic bag. The other ones were dropped out of it. We'll treasure them with love. Aw, that's nice. They got carbonara flavor too. Yeah, but that's like still part of like the spicy one. The spicy bulldog ones. I'm talking about like a completely different one. This is not like bulldog or anything. This is just, this literally just says Samyang on it. It's like a red packet. Let's see it. Confetti Color Star, thank you very much. Juliana, thank you very much. Uh, Prince Violet, thank you very much. I can't travel far, but the new job has been giving me more time to work on the Ike doll. Woo! The coat is coming along nicely. I hope I can show him to you. I hope so too. I would love to see it. I don't think I've seen a non-spicy Samyang pr product. It exists. Hold on. Let me let me let me find find it and show you what it looks like. Let's see. Here we go. Found it. Let me just... Let me just save this real quick. And let's bring it out. Uh, image. Get that. Here. These, these, these are the ones I usually get. I think it's the same Samyang as, like, the other ones. It's, you can see the Swedish text on it there. Beef smock. What, what does this say? Kukad i hundra percent... What? Vegeta... Vegetablisk? Vegetalisk? <laughs> I can't even read that. I've never seen this before. Maybe it's a Swedish thing. Maybe it's a Swedish thing. Yeah, these, these are the ones that I usually get. They're like super, super cheap. And uh, you just like buy buy a bunch and then uh, just just cook it. We see this guy. I mean, I like it. I think it's good. I don't. It's 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 still instant noodles. Like it's not gonna be like gourmet. One hundred percent vegetable oil. Like, uh, no. It said said something along the lines of boiled in one hundred percent, like vegetarian oil. I think so. Something I'm about one of those things. Beef smock, yes, beef flavor. <laughs> yeah, like I've I've never seen these like talked about anywhere. 
outside of Sweden, so I, I assume that the, these are only a thing here. I buy those too. Okay, so maybe they do exist in other places, unless unless you're Swedish. <laughs> I'm Korean, but I haven't seen these in Korea before. Then maybe they're it's like only for like under other countries. Maybe they need to dumb it down. Maybe they need to dumb it down for the Swedes because they, they, they don't know they don't know what it's supposed to be like. Rip off Samyang? I don't think it is. I would hope not. Do they sell them in IKEA? No, the, the these they usually sell at uh, Ika. Ika is like a, one of the biggest um, a grocery store supermarket kind of things in Sweden. It's spelled ICA. Good old Ika. Ika supermarket. Ika? No, no, no. You gotta drag it out. It's not Ika. It's Ika. <laughs> Ika musume? <laughs> Ika musume datte. No, it's not like Ika musume. Shinryak, shinryak, Ika musume. Natsukashi. Let's see, where, where where the heck was I? I got distracted by Ika Musume. Hmm. Uh, where was I? Uh, Kinikei, thank you very much. Aho san, thank you very much. Uh, uh, no mo aiku no o mirete Oh, うん、一言いただけませんか追加頑張れ。ありがとうございます。そしてお誕生日おめでとうございます。え、ニャイクからの一言、うん。どうしよう。え、I <笑> Maybe not today. Maybe some other time. The the day the day that I that I dig out the the cat ear asset. Then then you can have another another nyike line. I already have like uh, my pr my previous my previous instances where I've had to speak like a cat that get brought up to me constantly, <laughs> especially like when I lost to Shu and he was just like. You're you're not ending your sentences that one way, and I'm like, okay, fine. <laughs> Natsumeko, thank you very much. We travel with the Swedish meatball pack. That's the secret sauce right there. Ooh, I see. Sia, thank you very much. So happy to have a meet and greet with you. Thank you. I'm glad that you were happy about it. That you had a good time. It's always so much fun. Let's see. Pari Pari. Thank you very much. Hello, Aiki. I really enjoyed talking with you at the Koskoski. Uh, thank you for... Uh, oh, yeah. This is about this. <laughs> saying... And not saying no to the marriage proposal. <laughs> thank you very much. Uh, Itchi. Thank you very much. Kora. Thank you very much. Uh, let's see. Anemofu. Thank you very much. I bought the Neko Ike figure the other day. Oh, like the sleeping one? And it's so adorable, I want to squish it. I put it next to me when I study. Aw, that's nice. HC, thank you very much. Mm -hmm. Hmm. Uh, Misaki Carrot Cake, thank you very much for the circles. <laughs> Kini K, thank you very much. If you need to fight Shu, uh, you still can use your karate skill against Shu's Taekwondo. Uh, probably... But I haven't done karate in so long, so I'm a lot more stiff now. And it's it's way harder for me to like do like proper kicks. Like I, I cannot kick as high as as I used to. Like in the past, like when I was actively doing it or actively practicing it, like doing a head kick is like was no problem. That I could do that in my sleep. Now, eh, not so much. 
he stiff too, then we would just pull muscles together. Both me and Shu would do like a head kick towards each other at the same time, and then you would just hear our bones and joints go, and we would both collapse before anybody has even landed a blow. Let's see, Yoko, thank you very much for the Akaspa once again. That's so kind of you. Monatan, thank you very much. Let's see, Hera, thank you very much for the Akaspa. No double Suika, unfortunately. Sorry about that. Uh, Jinsha, thank you very much. Melinda Lin, thank you very much for the Akaspa. That is so kind of you. <gasps> Excuse me. Boom, thank you very much. Went to Costco Ski to meet you and it was a blast. You did amazing singing Blue Light Live. Hope to see you again someday. By the way, can you still remember any tie phrases? I do remember like the... Like for for whatever reason, w one of the li uh, like lines that I would ask to like say was like, like I love mom, or like, like I love moms in in Thai. Not entirely sure why that was, but I I'm not sure if it was like the word for like mom as in like mother, or if it was like mommy in the in this in this sort of. Like, like, you know, mommy, sorry, kind of, kind of context. For whatever reason, like, th that was, that was a thing that, that, that I, I was, I was made to say. <laughs> I learned a lot, but... How's it going see? <laughs> At least everybody seemed to be enjoying it, because whenever, like, uh, the MCs said something for me to repeat, and I said it, everybody got, like, super, super happy. And I'm just like, hmm. What am I saying here? <laughs> All the moms watching just went Tusk, <laughs> Moving on. Uh, let's see. Lucrees, thank you very much. I hope I'm saying that right. Oh, th th this this is the this name again. Kyono ban gohan wa kare desu. Arigatou gozaimasu. Thank you. Uh, Miss V Zara, thank you very much. Hayaki, in a few days I'm going to study abroad in Dubai and I'm very nervous. Do you have any advice or can you wish me luck? I just want to let you know that no matter where uh, where I am in the world, uh I'll always cheer you up and wishing for you to succeed. Thank you very much. And, ah, uh, oh, Dubai. I've never been to Dubai. But, uh, hey, studying abroad is a great opportunity for new experiences. And your boy is all about new experiences and sharing those with the world. So, maybe what you could do is uh, think of a bunch of things that you want to do. Like, like look up what, what there is to do in Dubai and, like, make maybe make, like, a bucket list. And it doesn't even have to be touristy things. Like, think of, like, I'm going to make... Uh, like two friends or like three friends or maybe what you can do is journal like write a diary or something because then you can just like go back and look at your thought process from day to day that's a lot that's a way better way to like preserve memories because it sort of unlocks memories when you're looking through your own thoughts from that specific date at least that works for me a lot not so much with, uh, like, diaries anymore. Like, I, do, I don't really journal, like, as I used to back in the day. But, like, just looking back at, uh, like, old DMs or, you know, pinned messages in Discord DMs when you say something funny. Like, some sometimes those pins go back years and years. And it just reminds you, of like, oh, yeah, we did do that. That was fun. Let's see, moving on. On Samita, thank you very much for the rainbow once again. That's so, so kind of you. Uh, Oploi Goldfish, thank you very much. I don't know why I pronounce it like that. Goldfish. Thank you so much for being at Koskoski. I had a wonderful time. Blue lights, fire, I'm crying. Please don't cry. That's not that's not the intended reaction. Uh, it cheered me up and helped me through the exam yesterday. Uh, today and surely for the next whole two weeks. <laughs> wow, that... That's a lot of energy. But thank you. Thank you so much. I'm glad to hear it. 
I still have my di diaries from when I was 12. Makes me want to uh, unalive sometimes. That's, that's fine. Like, looking back at old cringe, like, one day you're gonna be happy that you kept that cringe. Eventually, that cringe becomes nostalgia. And nostalgia cringe just hits different. Mm. I'm actually gonna cry at my younger self. I mean, we all do to some extent. For example, like back in the mid 2000s, when the term weeaboo was still sort of like considered an insult before, before the weebs reclaimed it. Like anime culture or like otaku culture in the west at that time it was so much more cringe than it is today we have learned from our mistakes you don't really see that level of cringe anymore but when i i mean i look back at those convention cosplay meetup from like 2006 2007 and just like the way that like cosplays looked at the time the, even the way that like people just dressed how different it was. I'm just like, this is so cringe. But this was my cringe. You know? So I just look back at that fondly. But at the time, oh no, absolutely not. That was, that was very, very much painful. And it was frowned upon <laughs> by most people. Myself included. Even though I was just as guilty of being cringe. I mean, cons back then were kind of wholesome in a way. Yeah, cons these days just don't hit the same. Like, when you went to cons back then, you knew that, like, you were, like, gonna be surrounded by, pe surrounded by people that are very much into something, like, like, n that is that niche. But these days you you'll find you'll you'll find any like normie like walking around with like a demon slayer shirt or something like that. That that was borderline unheard of back in the day. Like if you saw somebody with a ghost in the shell shirt and they knew where it was from, you knew that like, oh yeah, you're 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 like you're like weeb weeb. Dang normies in my weeb space. I welcome the normies, honestly, because the normies can be converted to weebs. I've never been too much of a fan of gatekeeping, except in certain cases. In certain cases, I will be entirely guilty of gatekeeping, and I will not apologize for it. <laughs> I mean, yeah, we didn't have FBI at recruiting uh, recruiting at cons. What? Okay, <laughs> is that a thing that happened? Because if if so, then what? What timeline are we in? Uh, moving on. <laughs> Sustaro, thank you very much. Laz, thank you very much. Uh, Anthe, thank you very much. TTTT, uh, -T -T -T, thank you very much. Let's see, did I read this one? Uh, I did not. Eto, konbawa, Aiku kun, konbawa. Kino wa watashi no tanjobi deshita ga, kyo no haishin o mite, ureshiku narimashita. Anata no yasashisa to koe ni takusan. Love you. Thank you very much. And happy birthday. Hope you had a wonderful time. That happened recently, so it's actually real. That's crazy. That's that's wild to me. Maybe maybe, maybe weebs weebs are smart sometimes. So maybe maybe they're trying to capitalize on that. Who knows? Uh, you Marissa, thank you very much. Haker, thank you very much. Uh, Himemo, thank you very much. Uh, hi, Ike. I'm so happy that I met you at Koskoski. Sorry for making your futaba do something 
uh, weird, like pulling paper from, from the mouth. Oh, yeah, that, the magic trick. I hope you had a wonderful experience at the event. I did. The, even besides the, uh, the scuff, the fact that everything worked out in the end and I was able to meet everybody and have, have a fun, fun blast with everybody made it all worth it in the end. Thank you for working hard as always. Thank you. Aoi-san, thank you very much. Uh, Ploy, thank you very much. Hi, Aiki. Thank you for coming to Thailand. I'm so happy to have a chance to meet you. I did cosplay for the first time to meet you in the meet and greet, and it was so fun. Blue light on stage was also the best. Thank you. Thank you very much, and thanks for cosplaying me. <laughs> no matter what the big booba cosplayer tells me, I'm not going to the military. <laughs> That is another amazing sentence. There have been some banger, banger sentences this, this stream coming from chat. I can just imagine a bunch of weebs passing a cosplayer and just like, No! Hold the line! Resist the cosplayer! Do, don't go for the army! Ah, oh, my nose is so itchy. Yeah. Chat is goofy today. Chat is always goofy, but see, that's what I like about chat. We must stay strong, brothers. Do they actually have a cosplayer or are we memeing? Because, it, like, if the army actually had a cosplayer to, like, do promo, then that's, that's crazy to me. They did? It was Misato from... What? Um... Do they know? Do they- do- do they know? I- I don't know if that- uh, I don't know- uh, okay. Okay. <laughs> Uh, okay. I'm just gonna roll on from that. <laughs> Let's see, moving on. Uh, where was I? Kinyako, thank you very much. Uh, Peach Kimi, thank you very much. This is my first super to say thank you for the meet and greet at Koskoski. Sorry that I sca scared you with... There's an empty space here for some reason. At the same time, you're always... Motivating and encouraging. Oh, thank you very much. And you didn't... Uh, I don't recall being scared at any point, but I'm glad that you had a fun time. Thank you. A real do-it-for-her situation? I don't know. Just... It, it's an interesting choice. On, on one hand... Fitting? But maybe not for the right reasons. I feel like I feel like a better one. Wouldn't Kantai collection would have would have been better? Because like those are like military ships, aren't they? That would have made sense. <laughs> get in get in the army, Shinji. See, moving on. Let's see, Lucrece, again, thank you very much. I'm sorry if this is bad, but the keys felt like a chain and for no reason. And I just wanted to say woof. I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry if it's bad. Oh, like a collar? Does this actually sound like a collar? I guess kind of. Uh, but not, like, really. It does? Now why do you know what a collar sounds like? I'm just asking. I have a dog. Sure you do. <laughs> Moving on. <laughs> uh, Tenno, thank you very much. Uh, hey, Ike. 
I took Ike Pop at, uh, to see 1OK Rocks concert last Sunday. Let's go! God, I'm jealous of the puppet. Uh, let's see. Lucia, thank you very much. Uh, Nise, thank you very much. Hi, Ike. It's mine and my younger sister's birthday today. Uh, can you greet us? Happy birthday. It would motivate me to live another year of my life. <laughs> There's plenty more to li uh, live for than just the birthday wishes of some 2D anime boy. But... <laughs> Thank you very much for the super chat, and happy birthday to you and your sister! Hope you both have a wonderful time. I mean, a certain fox had collar merch? Did Mista have a collar? Oh yeah, he did, didn't he? I forgot about that. I mean, wasn't wasn't his membership called like ownership? So that that kind of makes sense though. It's like somewhat thematic. But now that I think about it in hindsight, it's just that was kind of sussy, wasn't it? But eh, somewhat on brand, I guess. It's been almost two years, Ike. Listen! The boy has bad memory. <laughs> when you get your one million celebration merch in the future, what kind of a merch would you like it to be? No comment. Let's see, moving on. Where where was I? Let's see. Gina, thank you very much. I'm so glad to see you at Costco Ski. You're very cute when speaking Thai. Well, I'm, I'm I'm glad that I was that I was I would if I had to pick between stupid and cute, I would pick cute. And I really liked you singing Blue Light. You sing very well. I'm proud of you. And Rakna uh, night. Thank you. Thank you very much. Snee, thank you very much. Pay for the apple. Thanks. 125 Pon Pon san, thank you very much. Shigedu, thank you very much. Sketch, thank you very much. Koshitan, thank you very much. Roku, thank you very much. Kora, thank you very much. Alina K, thank you very much. I'm planning on getting an Ike Pape soon, and I just want to put him in my mouth. He is so cute. Literally just a little guy, yummy in my tummy. I... It's made out of fabric, so probably don't eat that. Mm, let's see. James Norlin, thank you very much. Uh, Fancy Chen, thank you very much. Alina K, thank you very much. Cora, thank you very much. Intama, thank you very much. Marla Peace, thank you very much. It's uh, Ki Moon Leaf, thank you very much. Uh, Roku again, thank you very much. Intama, thank you very much. I'm not reading this super chat out loud, but wow. Uh, that is quite the hospital visit. Hopefully you didn't you only had to do that once. A lesson was hopefully learned, so you didn't do that again. Good lord. Uh, moving on. <laughs> wow. Yus, uh, thank you very much. Tong Tong Joy, thank you very much. Uh, Hiroshi Ishida, thank you very much. Ryan, thank you very much. Hey, I say Suika in enthusiastic voice. Love you. <clears throat> Suika! There you go. That, that's enthusiastic, probably. Amiya, thank you very much. Uh, Aoi san, thank you very much. Haruka san, thank you very much. Uh, let's see, where were we? Uh, Mintaka, thank you very much. Uh, Lucia, thank you very much. Hey, I, I just remembered something else. Happy Nike Day. Uh, and when you sang uh, Blue Light at Koskoski, I felt it from the bottom of my heart. 
Uh, oh yeah, we, we read this a little bit earlier. Thank you so much. Uh, done. Thank you very much. I just got to refresh so I can get these additional ones left. Let's see, where was I? Uh, Arui-san, thank you very much. Aiku-kun, konbawa, konbawa. えっと、え、この間 たかったです。かな。読み方間違えたかな。友達も来てまたその人にいや、会いに行きたいなと思っています。アイク君がおすすめしていたガムんガムラスタン。お、ガムラスタン。いや、他の他にもスカンセンにも行きました。おお、いいじゃん。スウェーデンに行きたいと思ったのはアイク君のおかげです。最高の思い出になりました。ありがとう。日本から応援しています。ああ、いいじゃん。ありがとうございます。嬉し
ん木なのと言いますか、名前覚えて、いて、うん、覚えていてくれたら嬉しいです。ひな、ひなのさんかなひなのさん。えー、いつも一緒に、えー、応援しています。頑張ってください。ありがとうございます。ママのスパだ。Wow,、uh, it's a mom. <laughs> That, that's another mom to add to the list. <laughs> Thank you so much. From Yuki san and Hinano san. Thank you very much. Thank you very much for the support. That's so cute. Aww. That made me all, all, all warm and fuzzy. <laughs> Mama spa. <laughs> You've heard, of, you've heard of an Aka Spa. Now get ready for the Mama Spa. The fabled Mama Spa. <laughs> Let's see, moving on.、Uh, Makochi san, arigato gozaimasu. Happy Nyaik Day, Happy Nyaik Day. Kisashiburi ni、uh, Suika game o play してくれて arigato. Kyo no hai shin mo. とっても楽しかったよ。ありがとうございます。それならよかった。嬉しい。You, Marissa, thank you very much again. Pop Trade, thank you very much. Nice to have an opportunity to see my boy at Koskoski. I got so much happiness. I hope that we have a second chance to meet you in Thailand again. I hope so too. えっと、夏頃さん、ありがとうございます。Thank you so much for the Akaspa. Koskoski, お疲れ様でした。ブえっと、トラブル。えー、なんか忘れてしまうくらい最高のステージでした。タイに行けて、クエルジンたちと一緒にブルーライトを聞きて、ヘッドバーンができて幸せでした。ありがとう、アイキー。ありがとうございます。Oh, I'm so glad to hear that. Oh man, I would have loved, I would have loved to see everybody headbang. That's next on the bucket list. I want to see, see how many people I can get to headbang during a performance. One day. One day. Let's see. Raboni or Raboni. Thank you very much. Hi, Ike. Today's stream was awesome. My name is. Oh, how do, how do I say this? Oh, God. How do I say this? Gutsjan? Gutsjan? December 1st is my birthday. Do you mind if I want your birthday wishes? Of course. Happy birthday. Hope you have a wonderful time. Uh, you, Marissa, thank you very much again. And、uh, Garan, thank you very much. Suika, what's called some of this? Mosio Kereva, Aikuga, Ichiban Skina Bokaro Kyoku, Shiritai des. Ichiban Skina Bokaro Kyoku, wa, Jiwata Neho san no Mirai e no signal. That's not just my favorite Vocaloid song, it's my favorite song, period. Highly recommended. It's such a good song. Let's see. Harunana. Thank you very much. Koskoski Super Chat. I'm so glad that I got to meet you in person and I forgot to introduce myself. Hope you like my little gift, little cinnamon roll. So sad that I can't send him to you. It is unfortunate indeed. But thank you so much. I still appreciate it. It's the thought that counts. And let's see, the last few ones is Leo. Thank you very much. Otsaiki, thank you for the stream. By the way, I'm planning to go on a, to a Miku concert next year. I'll be sure to bring my Aki Pape with me. Let's go! Please bring Tiny Me. Bring Tiny Me since I can't go. Let's see. Guki. Guki Alala? Guki Alala? I hope I'm reading that right. Thank you very much. Hi, Aki. Thank you for the stream. Wish me the best for my Aka Papers. Next week. Love you lots. Thank you very much. And gamba on the papers. You got, you show, show those papers who's boss.、Uh, Seyo, thank you very much for the suika. All right. That was all of them. Thank you all so much for coming. It was fun doing a little bit of suika after such a long time. And it's, a, it's kind of fitting with everything that's going on right now with the tournament. And we got plenty of time to like catch up, talk a little bit. I got to chat your ear off. All that good jazz. And fun times.、Mm. Okay, I'm gonna go and continue to get my 
my stuff together. I still have a, a couple of responsibilities that I need to attend to. So, yeah, thank you all so much for coming, and, oh, wait, right, thank you very much for the super chat. Happy Nyike Day, happy Nyike Day. All right, ya yeah, boy's gonna be off now. Hope you had a wonderful day, day, evening, morning, night, whichever it is. And uh, I hope that you have a good, continued good day or sleep if your day is coming to an end. And I will see you all in the next stream. Bye-bye. And just like that, ya boy's off. Woo! I just had an idea. Okay, we're gonna raid someone, but they're not in Niji Sanji. You guys okay with that? Okay, cool. <laughs> Alright, let's do this.